Okay, we're counting down. We're, we're, we're live. Oh, we're live. Okay, well, since we're live, I will tell you that we're trying to make pink. Pink and, lipstick. And. Oh, show them that color. That color is pretty. That's pink, ain't it? I think that's a nice pink. That's what I call pea pink. Now, what you're, what you're going to see <laughs> is that. What did she say? <laughs> um, what you're going to see is little lumps, but that's because the whipping process took long, too long. And some of it is starting to, but when we're making it, get your finger out of it. Well, it's not like I'm going to lick my finger. So we're making lipstick for two reasons. One, because she's going to put that in her apothecary store. And two, we're going to customize some of this as uh, pucker up impressions lipsticks and use them for our lipstick readings. And, um, isn't that pretty? We have we, what, the first one we have is called Desert Rose, and what would you say? That's kind of a reddish coral. Yeah, and kind it's of a dusty. Yeah, it's beautiful. I love it. So we wanted a bright pink and a bright red, so we'd have three different colors. So this is our second color. God, look at your fingers. You're a mess. Well, that's you're what like happens a, when you're trying to create something. You're like a kid. Yes, I am. I'm expecting you to shove both hands in there and just start playing with it like Play-Doh. Well, the unfortunate thing is I don't think that we can pot this because there are too many lumps. But I but, can give it to you to try. Yeah, because here's, here's the need that we have for pucker-up impressions. It has to have a nice color. It has to sustain most of that color so that when people put it on and kiss a card, we can see their lip print. And we have to be able to um, pot it. Is that right? Pot it? Well, yeah. Put it in the container. Put it in the container and distribute like this. It. Like this. Yeah. Just a little pot. So those are cool. And she puts a label on there. said, made exclusively for pucker up impressions by Luann's Herbs. Herbal Lou. Oh, well, forgive Herbal me. Herbal Lou. Well, get Herbal it right. Lou. Herbal Lou. Get it right, baby. Oh, and I haven't shown you this. Do you see this? Uh-uh. This is going to be... Oops. This is... Oh, my God. <laughs> this is to put samples in. Oh. You open it. You squirt your sample in. You use a flat iron to seal it. That's cool. And you put your label on it. That's really cool. Isn't that cool? Is that cheaper than the pots? Um, I believe it is. We might we might have to work on some other options then. That's cool. Well, you know, uh, I also can I can also put like one tablespoon of elderberry syrup in this. Ooh, you can get all kinds of samples. Yeah. But Call for your free samples now. The, uh, <laughs> oh my lord! I'm hoping to have a, a sample box ready by February first. Cool. So, uh, but with the elderberry syrup, it takes you have to sanitize the table. All the equipment, everything. I mean, it's not just about putting it in there. No, we're just we're mad scientists today. We're just yeah. we're playing with this color is, and texture. We're just playing with color and texture and. Uh, so if I fall down dead tomorrow, you know she poisoned me. I did not poison you. <laughs> All of this stuff was clean. Clean team. I pulled my hair back. Clean I washed teen. my hands several times. Clean team. I even grated my fingers. Do you know what movie that's from? My daughter's a clean teen. Hairspray. Hairspray? Yeah, they're saying that Tracy has uh, roaches in her hair. She goes, she does not. My daughter is a, my Tracy is a clean teen. <laughs> Okay. I'm just a random box of trivia. So that is a random box of trivia. So, uh, why did they think she had roaches in her hair? Oh, this is this is like a parody of what was going on uh, in the 60s in Detroit City during the race tension. Mm -hmm. And so I remember this even as a kid. If you if you wanted to say something bad about somebody, you would say, oh, they have roaches in their hair. Oh, well, I did not know that. Yeah, that was a big thing. I didn't know it was a big thing everywhere, but it was a big thing where I grew up. Ooh, someone has roaches in their hair. I never saw anyone with a roach in their hair ever, but you always heard that. So she's just stirring and stirring, and stirring and stirring and and yelling at myself. Um, I don't know if if I remelted this, I might try that. I might try to remelt it and see if it actually um, 
Hey, we're taking suggestions for names, too, for this yeah, tank. Yeah, pink. My preference is that all the names have the word rose in them. So the first one was Desert Rose. So if you can come up with a pretty pink name with the name Rose in it, that would be awesome, and I'll vote for that first. <laughs> they probably ought to look up... Um, oh, you know what would be a good name? Hmm. Herbal Rose. Herbal Rose? I'll Whoa. write that down so I don't forget. All right, I got to go test all this stuff, so. Okay, go test it. All right, see y'all later.